Hi guys, this will be your video on how to mix up Menopure. So your Menopure is not a refrigerated medication, so it'll come in a box like this. In this box, there'll be two boxes inside, one like this and one like this. So these are the Q-caps. These are an apparatus that is used to help mix the medication, okay? In this actual Menopure box, there will be 10 vials five will be the actual medicine and five will be fluid sodium chloride water saline whatever you want to call it so the actual medicine <clears throat> is this little vial it says menopure on it and it has a peach cap okay that's the actual medicine depending on what your dose is you are either going to use one of these or two of these i will let you know so on your protocol paper it'll either say one vial of menopure or two vials of menopure <clears throat> okay so if you're one vial of menopure what you're going to have in front of you is the actual menopure with the peach cap a bottle of saline okay in this bottle there's two cc's of fluid you're only going to be drawing out one unless we tell you otherwise so there will always be leftover fluid in here you do not need to save it you could throw it right out okay <clears throat> so you will have those two you will have a 27 gauge half inch needle. You will have a three cc syringe with no needle attached to it, okay? And then your Q cap. All of your IVF medications <clears throat> that are injectable medic medications are going into your subcutaneous skin. So that's under your skin into fatty tissue. So that can go anywhere around your belly, stay away from your actual belly button, okay? So stay like an inch away from your belly button, go out side of that so anywhere on your belly you can go on the side to your love handles you can go on the side of your thigh okay so wherever there should be fatty tissue okay when you go to do this you want to have clean hands and have a clean area okay the first thing you're going to do is start with the fluid vial okay you're gonna flip that cap right off you're gonna take the Q cap you're gonna peel this off or it comes in another way also you're gonna peel that off you're gonna take the vial and the Q-cap and just push them right together, okay? It's like a little hat. Once you have that on, you're gonna take this plastic part, okay? Make sure the Q-cap is on good. Then you're gonna take your 3cc syringe, you're gonna open that up. You are going to draw up one cc of air. Now you can see on here, there's a one with a darker line. Uh, thicker line, excuse me. You're gonna go up to that, okay? You're gonna put the air in the syringe. You're gonna take this syringe with air and twist it on to the Q-cap, just like that, okay? You're gonna turn it upside down. You're going to push the air into the, um, all into the vial, and then you're gonna pull out past the one. If there's any tiny air bubbles there, you could tick them out, and then you're just gonna push up to that one, okay? Once you have your one cc of fluid, you are going to hold the syringe and then just pull this glass vial straight off, leaving the Q-cap on, okay? So the vial comes on and off very easily. You have the one cc of fluid in here. You're gonna go to your Menopure vial, which is, again, it says Menopure on it, has a peach cap and it has a chunk of powder in it, okay? You're gonna take that cap off. You're going to push the Q-cap onto the vial okay you're going to inject all of the fluid in and you're going to swirl it gently do not shake it give it nice little swirls as if you're swirling uh, coffee or something okay you're going to swirl that around let it mix it mixes fairly quickly it will be clear just like water you're going to turn this upside down if there's any air in the syringe you're going to push all of that air in and then you're going to pull everything out until you have your own air line there, okay? So you'll have a chunk of air at the top that's perfectly fine. If your dose of Menopure is two vials of Menopure, what you are going to do is once you've drawn all the fluid out of your first Menopure vial, you're just gonna pull the Menopure vial off and then you're gonna go to your second vial of Menopure, attach it on, inject everything in, swirl it, and then draw everything up so that you have a more concentrated dose of Menopure, okay? Once you have that second dose in here, you're going to twist this vial off with the Q-cap, and then you're gonna twist on a needle top, 
If there's any air bubbles in there, you could tick them out. And then you're just going to take the safety off and you're just gonna push up slowly till you get your own bead of fluid at the tip of the needle. Then you're ready to go. You're gonna make sure that your skin is clean. You're gonna take an alcohol swab, clean the area, let it air dry. If you stick a needle through skin that's wet with alcohol, it'll just burn a little bit more. Okay, once it's all dry, you're gonna pinch the area. You're gonna go straight in, inject it all in, and then pull it straight out and throw it in your sharps container.